Yo, GameBro here, and of course along with... Take a wild guess! And the valve being not left off, we got through the first part of the next part after the first boss, so we're struggling our way through a mummy desert themed filled monsters forest where we are making our way to... um... <laughs> what? I don't know my train of thought. We're just uh, here to collect some goodies. We don't necessarily you know, have to. Run from it. We don't necessarily have to be here. And this is called the Glencoe Forest, by the way. Oh, and I got a new move called Soul Searcher. I better show it off for too long. What exactly does Soul Searcher do? You'll find out shortly. Uh oh. Don't let. Don't let those tree Let's enemies. Level one, so. It didn't work, but basically with it you can see your stats. Let me try it again and see if it'll work. There we go. Well, it worked on him. Useful if you want information about enemies. So it's basically like scan. First game. Kind of like, um... Tattle except you don't see their H how much HP they've lost. How much HP they had and what their stats are. So you'll know how long it is till you kill them. Ah. Uh. Boom shakalaka. Fire ball. Indeed hot. Oh. Another victory, I claim. By myself having to heal almost every battle. At the slow you, you'll be finding yourself doing that a lot. Healing is your best friend. Can I healing say healing is your frenemy. As much as you heal less, you still keep going. Um okay. Um I so I sometimes have a hate love relationship with it because while I'm trying to run away from them I heal up. Okay, let us enter this cabin. And who's this forest. lady? Kelly, follow the cynic valley into the forest and you will come upon a blue cave. But I can assure you that the road will not open without permission from the spirits. We will not hurry about that long blue cave anytime soon. It's long, I tells you. But I'm getting a bit ahead of myself. Why would they have an extra room with nothing in it? A pointless room once again. Pointless room is pointless. Once again, it serves no purpose. Much like 90% of the game. They must have had something planned before they skipped the rest of the development. Mm. They're probably like, eh, we're gonna skip it. If, just ship it out. If only this game wasn't rushed. Okay, let's try out the silver amulet. No attacks, no enemies will execute on you. will dispel it. Only a certain amount of time will. Uh, Ah, frickin'. Ah, what a disappointment. Because I don't know. But I do. Actually, I don't. You don't. Dodge and randomly missed, thankfully. Ah! 
Sheesh, um, the enemy must have high evasion. Oh, am I now constantly missing somebody? Um, If I'm careful, I should be fine. Should be fine. Should be able to handle the next boss without any healing items. Can you handle that? We shall see. And here's silence. Level one. It's like restriction, except the enemies can still move. Turn. Some more dark goblins, of course. Not screw it, run away. Heal your way up. Heal! So, um, spoil the yeah. rest of this yeah. forest. And I still have the ceiling spell to show off as well. Yeah, this forest is fairly large. Um, one. And yet you don't even have to be you don't even have to be in here. Alright, um Over there is actually a path to the blue cave that is mentioned, but we cannot enter there just yet. Once we make progress we can once we make it to the blue cave we can come back in here, but we have no need to. I'm just saying here and now. Um, so, um, now that we've pretty much explored this forest, um, too bad I can't use any wings. No. Sadly, sadly, sadly. Um, Ah, here's a spirit there. I don't know. I didn't notice it before, but um, it should try out silence on somebody. Forgive me if I miss any spirits, but they are pretty easy. Some of them are pretty easy to miss. Okay, let's 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 try it. Silence. Just like restriction, they're useful, but only if they're actually reliable, which is hard, which is usually not reliable. There we go. Again, they can still move, but um, leaving themselves vulnerable. Ah, after one turn. You're kidding me. Has a high miss rate and a low duration time. Use your fist of fury. Every spirit in the double digits. Learn nothing new, it seems. Um. So, <clears throat> I guess we're pretty much done here. We faced all the enemies we can, but there are still enemies we haven't faced at the Dondran Plains, or whatever it's called, just yet. Perhaps I could show off another item soon. Um, well, there's a silent flute. Um, Thunder. Can I get that a try? Or that? 
if I'm correct, it's pretty much guaranteed to work, so... Yeah. It is quite useful indeed. But, um... But since I was a physical attack and not a special attack, that mummy still managed to hurt me. It silences them, they can still randomly melee attack. But the vast... It doesn't have any melee attacks, it just has physical... Uh, uh, magical attacks, not physical. You know what I mean? Indeed, um... But so, so many of the enemies just have special attacks in this game. So it's still ultimately really useful. We are done here. Haven't really given you viewers a chance to listen to the whole song, but the music does get a bit creepy for the second half. On the same level as like the first half for the counterfeitress. So many freaking mummies. So many boulders. Don't know where they got them, but they just throw them. Yeah, um. Magic. There are so many other special attacks you could have with a mummy. But why a boulder? Yes, um, so yes, so we've, we finished with that optional area, and here's some new enemies before I'm going to end the video. Um, I believe they have one cutter level two, Apophis is, I believe Apophis is named after, like, some Egyptian snake demon. Uh, yeah, Apophis, like on, uh, Stargate SG-1. You know what I mean? Yeah. You ever watch the, uh, show Stargate SG-1? Never watched it before. Well, there was an antagonist called Apophis where it's basically an Egyptian god. And I'm starting to notice more desert-themed enemies in the forest or fields. You must have got the desert enemies mixed up with the forest. Are you going to find the forest enemies in the desert now? <laughs> well, I'll have to find out, Tom. Say some. Right. I don't think I'm missing any spirits I'm from what I've explored. Nope, I'm good. Um... We're gonna make more progress in the next part, that'll be all. See you all in the next part.